Hi. In this session, we will observe and we will discuss what is blue prism architecture. Okay. It's very simple one. So let me open this architecture diagram. Just observe this for so one or two seconds. Here, uh, before discussing this, what all the things we have there in Blue Prism when you are developing any process, what all the things it will be involved. We have Process Studio and we have Object Studio, right? At the same time, so this Object Studio, we are going to create business objects or we are going to use any existing VBOs right after that when it is coming to the process studio we are going to create business rules that's it right business logics all the things it will be involved so observe this diagram now so what are the things it is here if you observe see this process studio and then object studio and in object studio we have VBOs and then business rules and then user interface this related to any application what is the main purpose of object studio to interact with applications right the same thing they mention here in application what we will be having application business logics right same thing observe the diagram object studio visual business objects and then user interface and then application business logics all these things whatever the things we have created in object studio actions where we are going to call those actions we are going to call those actions in process studio now observe this here we have connected to process studio all these things available in blue prism process where it is going to be connected it's connected in blue prism database blue prism internal database that's a sql server right how it is going to control by control room where we are going to deploy so it will be in a control room scheduling and then deployment it is done in control room the same time so when we are login we are going to connect with username right where they are going to create username and password in system manager so when we are logging with username and password it will connect to the database it will authenticate so whether you have a access or not so then it is going to launch your blue prism understand right so this is the complete architecture of blue prism it's very simple no need to get confused here so only what are the things we are using those are the connectivity just relate it then you can understand very easily so what it mean by blue prism architecture thank you